हेलो आई एम सार्थक अ क्लाउड सपोर्ट इंजीनियर हेयर एट द ए डब्ल्यू एस ऑफिस इन बैंगलोर समटाइम्स कस्टमर आस मी हाउ दे कैन सेट अप एक्टिव डायरेक्टरी फेडरेशन सर्विसेज और ए डी एफ एस एज अ सैम्बल प्रोवाइडर विद एमेजोन कॉग्नेटो यूजर्स लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड आफ्टर लॉगिंग इन इन टू द ए डब्ल्यू एस मैनेजमेंट कंसोल चूज सर्विसेज एंड देन चूज कॉग्नेटो Amazon Cognito user pools allow federated sign-in through a third party including through a SAML identity provider such as ADFS. In this example, we'll set up an ADFS server on an Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud Windows instance and then integrate the setup with our user pool using Amazon Cognito's hosted web UI. There are few steps to complete to get this setup configured. So let's get started. First, I'll create an Amazon Cognito user pool with an app client. Give the user pool a name. I'll use ADFS Cognito. For this example, I'll just choose review defaults and then create the pool. Note that when creating a user pool, the standard attribute email is selected by default. Now, I'll add an app client. Choose App Client under General Settings and then choose Add an App Client. Give the app a name. I'll use ADFS Cognito app. Clear the Generate Client Secret checkbox and then choose Create App Client. Note the app ID. You'll need this later. Under App Integration, choose a domain. The domain must be unique globally. I am choosing ADFS SAML. Note the domain provided. Next, I'll set up a ADFS and IIS on an EC2 instance. I am using a Windows Server 2016 base instance, and I have also added an Elastic IP address to the instance. Also, I have an Active Directory domain configured. To learn. how to set up an ec2 windows instance and then set up an adfs server and domain controller onto it go to the steps mentioned under set up an ec2 windows instance in the aws article linked in the description section of this video next i have created an active directory user with an email address i have named the user sarthak with the email address as shown on the screen the email address is important as it's used to authenticate the user finally to test that everything is working i'll download the adfs metadata after the information is downloaded note the metadata url let's complete the amazon cognito configuration we'll go on to the identity provider section which is under the federation Therein, we'll choose SAML. In the SAML field, the metadata document will provide the metadata document endpoint URL. That would be the same endpoint URL that was there. I'll use ADFS Cognito SSO in the provider name. Enable IDP sign out flow. Create provider. Next, please select App Client Settings under the App Integration. Here we'll choose ADFS Cognito SSO. So I've created my app client in there. Lastly, I'll map identity provider attributes to the usable attributes. For that, we'll go to the attribute mapping. Saml. I add a Saml attribute. To test the configuration, let's go to the App Client setting menu and launch the hosted UI from there. Let's authenticate using an Amazon Cognito user pool that uses ADFS.
I am now authenticated by ADFS and redirected to my Amazon Cognito callback URL. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.